And finally for today's program, let's turn to Benjamin Baker for a look at Adventist history. Thank you for joining us again on This Week in Adventist History. This week on May 24, in 1896, Norma Ione Rhodes was born in Sutherland, Iowa. On Christmas Eve 1916, Norma married Gustavus Benson Youngberg, a minister from South Dakota. In October 1919, the couple and their one-year-old daughter sailed for Asia as missionaries. What followed the next 25 years was pioneering ministry in Singapore, Malaysia, and Indonesia, where the Youngbergs shared the gospel, often for the first time, with the Jayak, Tatao, and Dusun ethnic groups. Gus Youngberg ultimately ended up dying of septicemia in a prison camp in 1944, after he had valiantly refused to leave his mission post in Borneo. The widowed Norma, mother of six children, went on to become one of the most prolific and well-loved Adventist authors of all time, publishing dozens of classic missionary books, including Nyla and the White Crocodile, Taught by a Tiger, Singer on the Sand, and Jungle Thorn, stories which inspired generations of youth to become missionaries, made thousands aware of the challenges and triumphs of Adventist efforts in underreported regions, and raised funds for missionary efforts around the globe. Teaching creative writing to thousands, Norma Youngberg died on August 20, 1984, in Loma Linda, California. And that was This Week in Adventist History.